Hey everybody, Carl here from the Airsoft Arena. Airsoft headquarters. Uh, this coming weekend, I am going to AMS's Operation Arsenal at the Muscatuck Training Center, which would be really cool. It's been like 10 years since I played there a long time ago. But this is my loadout video. Starting off with kit, I'll be wearing my Tactical Tailor Mav vest, uh, circa me in the old days, the early 2000s. Um, things that I like about this, lots of storage space. Uh, I keep my radio here, standard Bao Feng, have it wired to a mast antenna on the back so it's not sticking up too much. Uh, backpack for food, BBs, the stuff you'll need to sustain you on the field. This one has a 2.5 liter hydration bladder in it and I'll, we'll also be adding a couple of 32 ounce things as well to stay hydrated. Uh, also in the bag, because I'm a hungry boy, we got two MREs. They'll probably be a third because we're gonna be out there for a while. Uh, on the front here, admin pouch, which maps, whatnot will go in. There's a standalone flashlight. Right here is where I put my Elite Force foldable tourniquet. It has the nice Velcro on it to stay on the helmet. Uh, this pouch right here is my toolkit. Uh, currently I got two Allen key sets. I have safety shears, uh, hockey tape goes in there, and various other small sundries that might need to be carried. The large side pouches. Uh, this will be used to carry my extra air tanks for my Kythera, and I'll show you why in just a second. So that is the best. Mentioning comms. Uh, Dual comp Heltor headset, lots of fun. Reminds me of the old days. Uh, helmet, the PTS M Tech Flux will be running a GoPro Hero 8. Back here, I have an extra battery pack to power the camera and the battery pack to power my action fan to keep my goggles clear of fog. If you haven't noticed, I'm wearing green, or at least my baby camo, the M81 Woodland, which I joined the Army in, uh, which means I'm going to be on the cost side of things. Uh, things you need for this event. Ace wraps to be your bandages for when you get hit. You got to have these, have to be at least 48 inches in length. Have those. I have a spare just in case I lose one. Probably won't, probably get a couple more. I am playing in the medic role this game, something I have been able to do a couple times that I find quite fun. Eye protection is a must. Uh, these are the Puremex Fixates. Great full seal protection, nice low pro, nice strap to make certain it stays on your head. Uh, I will either be wearing these or my Eye Forces. They're pretty much similar, just different, sh slightly different shapes. As I mentioned in a lot of videos, snacks are, man are key. We have Mexican street corn. Tex-Mex. Those are my salty snacks. I will be getting some beef jerky to add to that because I have a salty pouch and a sweet pouch. Sweet pouch has freeze-dried baby yogurts. They're tasty. Now, weapons. Primary is going to be my longer setup, Mark 18 Kythera. Listen to this. It's real quiet. Uh, mentioning the nine inch tanks, you see this? Or the nine CI cubic inch tank. It's about that big. I can get five of those in the side pouch. <clears throat> and if that goes down, in a very similar configuration, just a little bit shorter, my Tipman. Um, you guys know this is my probably my favorite gun in the world. I don't care what anyone says. This thing has never let me down. Serial number 0346. So yeah, that's that. I'm not taking a pistol. Uh, there's zero engagement distance, so I don't really need a pistol. May I, maybe I'll take it with me, I don't know. Who knows? Uh, with that, that's all I got. Um, yeah, that's all I got. If you have any questions, shoot us a message or whatnot, and I'll feel free to answer them. Take care.